Okay, this is this is going to be a very complex how-to. Okay, it is 2023 and our passports have expired. Uh, they expired, I don't know, eight or ten months ago. And fortunately, we have a grace period. So let me explain to you how to do this. You need to renew the passport. Okay, so watch this video and we'll show you a quick, easy way to do it. So now what? Now we have to go home and staple them to our application. <sighs> Too bad we didn't think to bring a stapler. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter because the post office is closed until 2.30. Yeah, this is so involved. <laughs> and we gotta go back out to go to the down. post office. <clears throat> so. So before we leave, we bathing suits on and then we go to the beach when we're done at the post office. Okay, so back up to the what should be the beginning of this video. How does one renew their passport, Jennifer? Well, if it's been less than 15 months, you can go online to... Well, less than 15... Passports.gov. Less than 15 months what? Oh, since your passport expired, your original passport. So you have a 15-month grace period and no more after your passport expires, which is 10 year period, right? Mm -hmm. I think I put in how to renew passport and then it brought me to, I think it was passports.gov or passports.us.gov. Yeah, make sure you're on the .gov website because there's a lot of middlemen that try oh, to, yeah. they, they swindlers, they get your money and they hold everything. They gum up the works. So it's very indirect and roundabout it's way to do easy it. Easy to just do it yourself. Yeah, just it's do it yourself. Jennifer all. filled out the forms for both of us, and it took ten minutes apiece. Oh, and we have to sign those. All right, and then we went and got our passport yeah. photos. First, we went to UPS store, and they said their camera or gear was down or their printer was down. Yeah. And then we went across the street to CVS, and by God, they were ready to go. Yay! So you fill out those forms, print them out, you put them in an envelope like she has here. Pretty soon we'll be in Maldives. <laughs> tells you how to staple your photos to it. How much did that cost us for photos? $33. Whoa, that's expensive. For, <clears throat> what would it be, uh, $16.50 each? Yeah. When I first got my first passport in New Orleans, I went to the, I think it was called the World Trade Center, or the World, or what was that? We did the same, no, we went to a post office and did it the that second time. building down on the foot of Canal Street yeah. in like 1981, 82. Mm -hmm. Yep, and they took my picture there. Check this out. This is interesting. I don't have much connection or many artifacts from these ancestors, um, but this this is my great grandfather Simeon Auguste Polonc, and this is a photo of an original travel document from 1911, a Swiss travel document. <laughs> yeah, you need one, right? Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to do that. Don't screw this you up, Jen. You don't want to smile. Is it for a passport? Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to smile. Look, look like a drug mule. I see you. <laughs> you look like a drug mule. <laughs> You have what? My old passport. You do? Yeah. Oh, we have to... Uh, you have to send it in. With... And they're going to send it back to us, right? For our great-grandchildren? -grand <laughs> Maybe. Okay. Wait, what'd you end up with? <laughs> I ended up with looking crazy. You do look kind of crazy. 
You look cute. I look like a very white guy. Yeah. Not very white. Very white. <laughs> oh, crazy lady. I mean, crazy. Yeah, you're all right. Here is my 10-year-old passport. I believe that's been 10 years. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Oh. I just found this bikini that I don't think I've ever worn. Let's see it. Here. It's pink. I let's, love it. Let's see it. One, two. Wait, back up. One. Okay. One, two. Oh, wow. Hey, I feel so privileged that we live at the beach. Me too. And we can just go. Whenever yes. that's so, so lucky. I mean, we don't live at the beach, but we don't live very far. No. Okay. I am so grateful. We go, excuse me. <laughs> so we go to the beach and then we go drop off our passports at the post office? No, we go drop off our passport stuff at the post office and then we go to the beach. Oh, okay. Are we ready? Yeah. I look crazy and not happy because she wouldn't let me smile it's weird how the how the law changed in 11 years yeah you look you look good for being 11 years older thanks you just look angrier <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh, geez louise this is very very good i guess i didn't come out yesterday we need to sell some of these for, for feed money, right? What'd you get? You're at 18. That's not 18. No. <laughs> I left the other ones downstairs because I figured we're going to bring them to Alan, right? Oh. oh, yeah. Aren't they pretty? They're beautiful. Love it. It's Thank Easter. Thank you for getting those. <laughs> I've oh. been laying around trying to get my, my vision back in my left eye and... It ain't going great. It is. I had full... You just can't tell right now. I had almost 60 or 70% back this morning in my left eye. And right now I can't see. I can Candy. see... A-OK. -okay. Yeah, I know. I can see lights and maybe light and dark and sh a little aye bit aye. of shapes. So what did the truck driver say? The Australian truck driver... Say to the aye, aye, aye. to the aye, aye, aye. to the man hitchhiking who had three eyes, uh, one leg, and he was armless. Aye, aye, aye! You look completely armless. <coughs> Open. Open. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're funny. <laughs> Believe you me, Missy. You have to do everything, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> what? Now I stick my hand out. What did go. you do? I come out. What did you say you did? I pet my girls. Jen. What? We're having a really hard time with YouTube. You can't be profane or vulgar or anything. These people need to get their minds out of the gutter. You, you just said I pet my girls. I pet my chickens. Oh, oh. My hens. Okay. And they're so cute. I don't know. Is it perfect? It's perfect enough. All right. Feels like a little hurricane coming. 